right, so welcome back everyone. <laughs> so we'll get ready to go into the transmission this evening. And I was just told during the break that the Syrians this evening are going to overlight the transmission, but there won't be a message. There actually is not going to be a message because we're going to go on a journey together and the energy will be kind of personal. They're going to speak to each one of us in an individual kind of a way through the transmission. So that's a little shift that I wasn't expecting. So that's cool. Um, so we're going to go into this transmission together. As if you're new to the transmissions, as we guide the meditation, what tends to happen is I will see things in my mind's eye and I'll be describing the energy process that takes place. But because the nature of this transmission is a little unique, it's more of a shamanic journey kind of an experience, there'll be elements of that kind of descriptive narrative in the meditation and then kind of a guidance as to how we process ourselves through the journey or through the, the process. And so stay attuned. So people who sometimes will fall asleep, like we talked about earlier, may notice through this particular transmission that you kind of stay with the process you'll stay aware, you're in a deep state of relaxation, but your consciousness for the most part, and you're experiencing things in that altered state of being. And uh, so just make yourself comfortable, um, kind of go into the, the process, prepare yourself for meditation as if we're kind of going to do a meditation together. And I'm, like I said, I'm going to actually play in the background during the transmission uh, this evening a little drum beat just to kind of help guide us along the process of what we're doing. I'm just going to start the music here. So just close your eyes, go inside, just breathe yourself into your body, your physical body. Take a nice breath in and exhale. And breathe in and exhale. With each breath, just allow your body to relax more and more deeply. Just kind of let any tension in your body go. If you notice any areas in your body that feel tight, just rotate your joints, move your shoulders, move your legs, just to try to let any energy open up and relax deeply into the body. And bring your consciousness into your body. Just imagine you're drawing it from your mind down into your heart area of your body. And as you focus on your heart and you breathe, you can see an energy in this space that begins to develop, like there's a light that's being turned on in the heart center. And just let that energy expand. As the intensity of the energy grows, it kind of moves into the tissues of your body and it begins to illuminate the energy space around your body. As if it's projecting in all directions through your body and into the space around your body. And we'll just allow for a minute for that energy to, to settle in, to expand And you begin to feel through your feet, through the lower chakras, your connection to the earth, the crystalline grid of the earth. 
And as you become aware of this connection, you may feel energy moving into your body from the earth to support you. And you become aware of your connection through your higher centers to the world of spirit, to the stars, your crown chakra. And as this energy center opens, you may feel a little energy moving down into your body. And as the energy moves up from the earth and down from the, the crown chakra, it's blending in the body. And it creates a beautiful torus of energy that forms around the body, like a toroidal field. The energy is spinning through the torus. We're just gonna let this energy work for a moment to adjust the energy in our body. It's kind of helping us move into a space where we're grounded in the energy and receiving energy to support the vibration in the body. And as the energy settles in this way, you can imagine that you're beginning to float just a little bit above your physical body and rising in space. And we all find ourselves sitting in a quantum space together. We're sitting in a large circle and we're all facing inward. And as we join in this space, you'll feel the energy in your body and the energy of everybody joining in the group. And as we join together, the energy catalyzes in a way that we can feel its intensity or its power is magnified exponentially and a beautiful energy begins to flow through the group. And in the middle of the circle, we can see a fire that is burning like a campfire. And the flames of the fire are dancing. And a beautiful smoke of energy is rising from the flames. And there are beautiful swirls of energy that are moving around the fire in the circle. And as in consciousness, we rise above the circle just a little bit, we can see the form of a cross in stones and we recognize that it's the quadrants of the circle. And in consciousness, we move to the east, honoring the energy of the east And then we turn to the south and just take a moment to honor the energy of the south. And the west. And the north. And as we move around the circle in honor of these directions, we're also making a conscious connection with the sacred elements, the earth, the fire, 
the air, the water, the elemental forces of life. And as our attention focuses on these elemental powers, it's as if they flow into the circle and they're present with us in this space. The energy of the earth, the energy of water, the energy and consciousness of the air and the fire. And we bow our heads as we hold our hands together, honoring the earth below our feet. And we raise our head upward, giving honor to Father Sky, the star civilizations the spirit. And we draw our consciousness back into the heart center where we focus in this space and our connection with the creator, the divinity that lives within each one of us as a manifest human being a soul in a body. And in your mind's eye, you become aware of a pathway And as you look at the pathway, let it take form in any way that's aligned to you. It can be a pathway through a field or on the edge of a mountain along the seashore. And in consciousness, just allow yourself to begin to move along the path as if you're walking or floating along the path in your mind's eye. And as you move along the path, you come to a doorway. And you reach out in your mind's eye with your hand and you open the door and you look through the doorway as you prepare to walk through. And on the other side of the doorway, there is a scene or a setting. And it may be very different than the pathway you're walking on. Just let it take shape. And as you walk through the doorway, you're aware that you're walking, quantumly speaking, through a dimension or a space. And in the new space or the new energy, We're going to invite the presence of a temple, an energy space that's personal to you. And if you see the energy, just let it take form the way you see the energy. And if you're not seeing the energy, let your imagination speak to you. Just let it build the vision in your mind. There's no right, there's no wrong. And you find yourself sitting in the middle of this space.
And we're going to pause here for a moment. And we're going to invite from spirit a being, a messenger, a vision, a knowing that's personal to you. And as you connect with this encounter, this being or animal or crystal, whatever form it takes for you, you feel an energy between you. And just let this encounter speak to you. Let any message, any information speak to you in a personal way. And just acknowledge the energy of the experience with gratitude. And you begin to feel in consciousness as if you're floating up from this space. And around you is a sense of a cosmic sky. It's like you're in the space of the sky, the cosmos. And in front of you, a pathway made of light begins to take form. And you don't see the end of the pathway. You just put one foot down and as your foot is placed, it's as if the pathway illuminates under your foot. And just journey along step after step. And the pathway leads to a temple made of light, like a crystalline temple that's just floating in the space of this experience. And you walk up to the temple and you step up over the side of the temple, the stairs at the side and into the middle of this space. And as you walk into this space, you can feel a shift in energy or vibration. There's a beautiful elevated quality to the energy in this space. And just allow yourself a moment to be immersed in the energy of that experience. Just let this energy communicate with you. Let the energy touch you. Let it wash over you. And you're standing in the middle of this temple space. And as you look around, you can see there's a pathway in four directions, one from each side of the temple. And in your intuition, just let yourself move in one direction as if you're choosing the path you're going to take. And as you look forward to the path, you can see standing at the edge of the temple is a being, a light being. And they're there to walk with you, to journey with you. And as you approach the edge of the path, you acknowledge each other. 
and you feel an incredible light and love that's radiating from this being. And they raise their hand just to guide you to take your steps along the path and you begin to walk along the path. And as you walk along the path, you come to a place where there is a seat at the side of the path. And for a moment, just pause and imagine that you're taking a seat And as you sit down, there's an energy that begins to flow from above in a spiral fashion down around your body. And just let the energy wash over you in this way. bow your head just to acknowledge the gift of this energy. And you stand up and you continue to walk along the path. And as you move forward and you look ahead, it's as if there is a waterfall of energy, but the energy is washing down over the path that you're walking on. And you have an awareness that you are able to walk right through the waterfall. And you continue and walk through the energy of the waterfall and you feel it wash down over your body. And you begin to feel very light, very luminous in your body as you come out through the other side. And as you continue looking forward, there's a ring of light around this path, like a rainbow, but in a full circle multi-spectrum colors. And again, you walk through this circle of light and you can feel the energy, the radiation of light. And you continue along this pathway. And you come to a place on the path where there's an energy portal. It's like a window of light. And standing beside the path on your right and left side is another being of light. And as you approach this space, they reach out their hands and take your hands in theirs your right hand holding the left hand of the being on your right and your left hand holding the right hand of the being on your left.
And while they're holding you, the opposite, their opposite hand reaches through this portal of energy, this window of energy. And as the, their hand enters into this space, we can't see their hand. It's as if it's moved through the dimension of this space. And they begin to draw their hands back through the portal. And as they do, they raise the hand, palm facing the light being on the opposite side. And between their hands, there is a scintillating geometry of light. It's made of a golden white light radiating like a luminous quantum ball of energy, gold and white and scintillating. And you can appreciate there's a geometry to the structure. But they turn to you and without words, they communicate. And they ask you if you are ready and willing to receive the energy. And as you acknowledge them and your willingness to receive the energy. They hold their hands over the crown of your head. And the beautiful form of energy begins to descend as if it's merging with your body or your energy field. Just let the light and the energy merge with your energy system as if it's moving down through the crown of your head to your heart. and acknowledging the beings. And they release your hand. And you turn around and you begin to walk back down the pathway. And as you walk down the pathway, you move again through the ring of light, the rainbow light. Through the waterfall, the energy waterfall. And you move back down the path to where you first saw the seat. And again, you sit for a moment in this space. And as you pause in this space, just feel the energy in your body as it integrates from the experience. before you and you see a picture frame. And in the picture frame, just allow a visitation. Just let yourself experience the energy in the picture frame. 
in whatever form appears within the frame. Again, it could be a being, a light being, an animal spirit, an element of nature, a crystal, whatever appears in the frame is specific for you. And as you acknowledge what you experience or see, you invite a message. Just let this object or being communicate with you in spirit through your intuition, through your knowing, and just let yourself receive a message from what you see. This message is meant to guide you on your path. And again, you bow your head, gratefully receiving the message and you continue on your path. And we come back to the temple where you started this journey, the light temple. And from this space, you return to the path that brings you back towards your personal temple. You begin to walk down the pathway and you move back into the space that you first encountered at the beginning of the journey. This temple or space that formed for you. And in this space, look around Observe what you see, if there are any symbols or elements of nature, crystals, beings, just look around whatever you see and just register anything you are able to see in this space. There may be a vista, a view. So you look off in the distance. And become aware that in this space, it's as if it is a lunching pad, a place you can go for communion with spirit, to meet with spirit. And as you pay attention to the details, they may change, they may transform. It's a quantum experience, so its nature can change and evolve. But this is a temple, a place where you can go in consciousness in your meditations to communicate with spirit. And the light being that was accompanying you on the journey stands at the side of this temple and they bow as if to acknowledge your journey together. And you do the same, you bow your head and 
honor of the encounter and you thank them for their guidance and support on the journey. As silent as it is. And we'll ask in this moment, is there anything else from spirit for you to be aware of or to receive as a message or an energy? And if so, just allow yourself the experience of seeing or feeling whatever is given to you. And from here, you turn and you begin to journey down the path to the space where we're all gathered in a circle. And we all regroup or meet in this space, sitting in a ring, looking forward as a beautiful fire dances in the middle of the circle. And as we sit in this space and look at the fire and we look more carefully in the circle, we can see there's a ring like a little pond of water in front of our feet. And the water is scintillating with light and the fire burns in the middle and a gentle breeze begins to blow around the group as if the wind moves around us in a circle, gently touching each one of us energetically. You may feel this little breeze on your face and you feel the support below you, the energy of the earth below you as we sit in this constellation of elements. And as the energy you bring with you from your journey is with you in this space, the energy of the elements begins to swirl very gently and they begin to dance around your body. There's a blend, an essence of all these different energies moving around your body moving through your energy field, through your chakras, you can feel the elemental forces in your being. And you have a sense that they're responding to support you, to the changes that you bring with you from your journey into spirit. She begins to settle and ease. And we begin to see again the structure of the place, the fire in the middle, the ring of water, the earth, and the wind begins to settle down. And there's a beautiful stillness over the place and you can feel this stillness in your being. It's a peace.
Just feel the stillness, feel the peace. And then gently from this place, you begin to drift down as if you're drifting down back into your physical body. Take your time. And allow your consciousness to return into your physical body. And you bring this stillness with you. You bring this sense of peace with you back into your body with all the energy of the journey. And you allow the energy just to kind of settle into the physical form like water moving into soil, as if you're bringing it back with you from the space of the journey. And in this place, you may want to stay in meditation for a little while but we're going to close down the meditation. And if you want to stay in meditation, just stay in the space and come back when you're ready. And if you're ready to come back now, you can begin to move your fingers, move your toes. And stretch your body. And when you're ready, you can open your eyes and come on back into the space. And I'm going to close off the microphone, but I'll stay present in the background. And if you want to uh, leave a comment in the chat box, we'll be here. And I wish everybody a beautiful evening or beautiful day. And just be gentle with yourself while you integrate the energies of this journey. Let the peace stay with you as you move back into the world. And from my heart, a big hug to each and every one of you <laughs> and blessings. <laughs>